we're happy to welcome Robert Kowalski back with us, the author of the eight-week cholesterol cure, the new eight-week cholesterol cure. Could you tell us a little bit about plant sterols, what they are, and how they fit into this whole equation? Oh, Lyle. It's one of the reasons that there is a new eight-week cholesterol new. cure, as a matter of fact. That's one of the things that I told my publisher when I said, I got to rewrite this book, not edit it, not revise it, do a complete rewrite, because I want a whole chapter that I'm going to call how to block the cholesterol in the foods that you love to, to eat. Block the how to block the cholesterol from ever getting into your bloodstream. They're just, just as all animal tissue, you, me, the foods we eat, all animals have cholesterol in the tissues. Mm -hmm. uh, can't live without it. In the same way, in the plant kingdom, there is a counterpart called phytosterols or plant sterols. Cholesterol is an animal sterol. In plants, we have the plant sterols. They are virtually identical in terms of a molecular structure. Really? Just one little, little difference. If you were to look at the molecular structures, which I actually put into the book so people can see the similarities. They're so similar, Lyle, that the human body can't tell the difference either. So if you take these sterols at about the time that you're eating a meal, especially, the body perceives those plant sterols as being cholesterol. They're taken into the little receptor sites, specialized cells called micelles, in the first third of the digestive uh -huh. tract. They, the body takes those into the receptor sites, and th those sites are limited. So once they're filled, they're filled. It's like how many rooms in the Holiday Inn? Isn't that interesting? Once they're filled, there is no room for cholesterol anymore. So when you eat foods with cholesterol, out it goes the other end. We can take it in a couple of different ways. One is with our meals at the beginning of a meal uh, as supplements, simple couple of tablets. For 10 years, I never ate a single egg yolk from 1984 to 1994 when I started reading and learning about the plant sterols. And I started experimenting. There was no product on the, 